guys how's it going MSG games here back with the fourth episode of the FIFA 18 Swansea career mode and today we are going up against Bournemouth in the Carabao Cup but before we do that if you do like the video leave a like subscribe comment down below share with your friends all that good stuff I made a big decision last game guys by simming the game against Tottenham we got a nil nil draw which is actually a very good result um, against Tottenham West Ham will tell you that good on them two bangers scored in that game Obiang and Son but this game, I'm also thinking about Simmon because it's very early on in the cup and it's Bournemouth. So I'm thinking, should I risk simming it? If I if I do win this and if I sim it, I will probably then play the rest of the games because I kind of want to focus on the league. Because as you can see, if, um, let's see here, if I can find it, please. Don't annoy me, please. Don't take like five years. B, C, there's no D. Oh, there is. We are. 14th well Swansea in real life are back to 20th so I'm technically I'm the better manager so I should probably go over to a Swansea right now and say hey I'm 14th in career mode sign me up anyway this is I'm gonna be playing a different a bit of a different squad it's, well it's more like the same except uh, two changes one into Saren Levin and one on the bench Leroy Ferro will be starting because when he's on he's actually pretty decent and then we have Carroll I can't don't know if it's Tom Carroll or Tim Carroll or I don't know just he's unknown from Spurs or he got permanent transfer from Spurs there's Fultz in here as well but Carroll is higher overall not to mention he's 25 Fultz is 23 fair enough but Carroll has better stats in general we have Ayu, Dyer, Carroll, Britton, Olsen, Mawson and Mulder on the bench Narsing Moonine, who on his debut against Leicester City, got us back in the game by getting a brace and we won the penalty shootout. Thank God. We also got a one all draw against Newcastle with a lovely volley from Tammy Abraham. Anyway, hopefully we can get the simulated win against Bournemouth. Right, there's um, Bournemouth's last three results. They've lost 3-1 to Brighton, 2-1 to Arsenal and they drew 2-0 with Man City. That's very good. Hopefully now we can get the first goal because usually if we might keep scores first we usually win in career mode anyway and we're off there we get yellow card oh fur yes right i'll wait till the 30th minute first scores in the first nine minutes skip 2-1 win oh chambers in the 45th minute and then they scored in i thought for a second there we scored in the 89th minute but i, got a, I don't have a guy with that name uh doesn't matter though swansea 2-1 win we're eight, further on now in the carabao cup we might have a cup run going on guys all right, just this training drill now. Let's see, can anyone go up and up overall? Renato Sanchez is up to a 77 with his ball control and dribbling going up. An effort. Jesus, Abraham, come on. He didn't even score that game. We have a game against Watford now who are only a point behind us in 16th place. I also might give Abraham a rest. Munain has to start because he's been in brilliant form. I think he got an assist in that last game. Burr has to start as well. Renato Sanchez, I might give Ki Sung Young a game over Mesa because as you can see my two um, centre mates Fur and Sanchez super high um, form well Mesa's eh but then again I don't really have anyone else who's like an arrow straight up actually I'll give Carroll a game why not he has the, he can play a CDM and if I look at his defensive stats oh god they are shocking He'll probably come on as a sub, actually. Um, I'll probably play, yeah, Ayu that game. I'm. Do I start Dyer over nursing? Yeah, fuck it, I will. What else? I'll play Olsen ahead of Cresswell. And that's it, right. D this is um, a team that's around our level. We're probably a little better than Newcastle. We were unlucky to get the three points, but Watford are a bit more our level. With the players I have anyway. Oh, international offer from Scotland. I'm sorry, Scotland, but it's a big no for me. And now let's see can we get three points against Watford. Hi there, everybody. Here we are, Premier League action. Swansea versus Watford. Let's see can we get three points at the Liberty Stadium for the first time this season. Alright, and dealt with nope it is not dealt with. Oh, it's corner, brilliant. Oh, brilliant. First injured. Okay, get rid of it. No, nope. didn't get rid of it. 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 Still haven't gotten rid of it. Ooh, big save by Fabianski. 
Oh my god, I thought they scored. Get rid of it, get rid of it. Right, come on. Oh, what is that pass? That is the worst pass he could have done in that situation. Huge deflection and it goes in. Fuck off. Really? That big of a deflection? Fuck's sake, Olsen. Pretty sure it was Olsen anyway. It doesn't matter, we're 1 0 down nonetheless. Ah, fuck me. Look at that pass. Hit it first time. Ah, that was going. Was this going right to Fabianski? Yep, that was going right to Fabianski. And then also chess in. And we're 1 0 down. Brilliant. Shit, sir. Oh, Mesa there. And half time, 1 0 down, thanks to a big deflection goal from Olsen. Brilliant, let's take a look at these half time stats. Uh, here we are. To be honest, we don't really deserve to be winning. We only have one shot on target. It was fairly easy as well. Uh, right. Oh, no, 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 not the trainer. We're going to take Fur off because of his injury. We're going to bring on Carol. Then I'm going to bring on Narsing for Dyer. And if IU doesn't start performing, I'll bring on Abraham. That's fair enough. Right, come on. We can do this. We can get the three points here. Come on, Olsen. Are you? Right now, Sanchez. Oh. Oh, wait. He's won it back. Lovely. Nice little back heel. Nice little back heel. Right. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are you? Blocked. Go on! Oh, saved out to the crossbar! You have to be joking! You have to be joking! It, the shot was blocked and it went straight to fucking Narsing. First touch the ball, saved onto the crossbar. So fucking close. Munain. Nice. Can he. Ah! I had asked for that pass earlier. Oh, he intercepted it though. Come on, Munain. Right. Wait for him. Good. Carol, make an impact, mate. Make an impact. Are you fucking blocked again? Ah, can't break through. When it comes to the final pass, we can get into position for shooting, but oh, we can't get the shots off without the defenders blocking it or the keeper pulling off a decent save. Oh, what a shit back you. Ah, can't even win a header. Opponents around him, that's good screening of Shit. the ball. Uh, come on for committing. The return ball. Alright, come on, get the ball, get again. the ball. Come on, Olsen. Right. Come on, Munain. Come on, Munain. Lovely ball roll. Nursing. I uh, can't get it. Oh, go on. Are oh, you pass it through? Nursing, come on, me. He's at the post, like, for fuck's sake, I'm nursing. You get a shot saved onto the crossbar, and now you hit the post. Jesus Christ, we hit the ball so much. We hit the ball so fucking much. We better get... We deserve a goal. We deserve a goal. We've been working so hard. We've been working so hard. We've been working so hard. We've been working so fucking hard. What a cross! Yes! Come on, Renato Sanchez! What a cross from Narsing. It's going out play. And Sanchez gets his first Premier League goal for Swansea. Look at this ball. Chest. Slide tackle. Bam! Sanchez rises above everyone else. Oh, we deserve this. Come on, let's try to push on for it. Oh, that's the second Premier League goal. I forgot who's. Did he score? He must have. Oh, in the same game, probably. Right, so. Are you? Fuck off. We need to get Tammy Abraham in the box. Get his big head on these. Right, come on. Come on, one all. We can do this. Tammy Abraham. Make me proud, son. Good man, Sanchez, by the way. Yeah. What an interception by Sanchez. He has to be man of the match. Oh my god. Abraham, please! Oh, fuck Carnezis! What is he? Oh, Abraham with his, one of his first touches of the fucking game. His first shot. And he nearly scores, but denied by Brindisi by Carnezis. Good, we could do something. I don't want to jinx it. 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 Oh, fuck! Fuck! Oh, damn it! Ah, we were pushing so much for that goal. But we couldn't get it in the end. We didn't lose. We should have won that game. It's... God. Ah, uh, God. This. I thought for sure I scored, but no. Where's this? This is it. Look at this. That was a shot. Was this going in? That was going into the roof of the net. And Carnezes touched it. Onto the crossbar. Unbelievable. 
Unbelievable. If Sanchez didn't get man of the match, then I'd be very disappointed. There you go. 8.7. Getting a goal from... Getting the goal from Narsing with the assist. <sighs> ah, we could have won that. We easily could have won that game. Alright, guys. I have some bad news. Leroy Fur is out for three weeks due to a sprained ankle. So that's fucking brilliant. That means Ki Sung Young will get more game time. Even though, to be honest, Carol did play a decent game. Some of his passes, however, were a bit shit. Alright, so Ki Sung Young will be our starter centre mid. Sanchez is tired. Everyone's tired. Abraham is and Narsing have to start. Because Ayu was bad. Narsing was class that game. Lovely cross. And Sanchez with a beautiful header. Always starting those counter attacks. Right, let's see who our next opponent is. We're still 14, thanks to that draw. We're up against West Ham. By the way, guys, Tottenham, I'm going to show you where, where they are right now. I know it's about that West Brom are on top of the table. I'm not sure if they still are, but you have to see this. You have to see this. Who has us on top of five goals? Tottenham Hotspur. Let's see here. Today, no, it doesn't show. Are in 17th place. One point off relegation. Arsenal are on top. Every Arsenal fan wishes that nowadays. Man City or Arsenal are the only two teams that are unbeaten so far. Uh, oh, I have to start Cresswell for this game because it's a former team. Bam. We're going to play this game against West Ham and I'll probably send the next game against. I'll have to take a look. Take a look here. We got something. No, it's just people leaving on international duty. My next game is against Huddersfield. So I'll end the episode off by simming this game against Huddersfield. Then we'll have... Then I'll play Leicester. I'll play West Ham. And I'll play Arsenal. Right, up against West Ham now in the London Stadium. Can we pick up our first three points in the Premier League now? Probably not. Right, so the commentators are backing me up. They think we're going to lose. So that's a nice thing. Cresswell going up against his former team. Ki Sung Young hits it. Oh, what a goal! Oh, Ki Sung Young in the first five minutes. What a wonder goal! He scored a Robin Van Persie header, and now he scored a fucking Stevie G classic. Lay it off to him, hit it first time, and it goes right into the back of the net. We're not missing Leroy Fair right now. Look at this first strike. Abraham lays it off to him, hits it first time. Not stopping that. I don't care if it's Joe Hart, Adrian, or fucking Neuer for all I care on goal. You're not stopping that. Keesung with his first goal of the season in the Premier League. What a fucking goal and what a way to start this match. Oh, Keesung will win that. Sanchez. Oh, Munayin. 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 Oh my god. Oh, he, I thought he did well by beating the defender there, but way too close to, it, to Adrian. Adrian. I call him Adrian. Look at Stoke City there. Stoke City in third, Certainly fuck me. Punching above their weight. Oh crap. Well, crap baskets. Oh crap. Oh shit. What start? Don't knock him down. Don't knock him down. Don't knock him down. Cresswell, where are you? No. Well, that didn't last long, did it? For some reason, Cresswell is... Oh, he's there now! But you're going to see here, Munain had to fucking go from left wing to left back to cover up for Cresswell, who's probably playing in the midfield. Ugh, God, fucking I hell! Say, Look, where is he? I mean, why is he up there? Andrei Ayew sticks it in. Yeah, I think we have. I not. I don't think it's his brother, but maybe a family member of his. They're both from Ghana. Ah, brilliant. So, one all. one all. Yay! Right, go on, Moon Nine. Ball roll, nice. But I think attacking players play Keys rather, on they? Young they do, to yeah, Benjamin Hendricks. And, uh, Sanchez, Abraham, 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 Abraham finds. Go on. And, uh, that is the. How do you go in Arsenal from putting a world class cross in against Watford to putting a cross like that in against West Ham? I don't know. I. Alright, he's offside. An easy one for the I think he's going to blow the whistle. The I don't think we'll get enough time for an attack. Unless... Luciano Narsing. To what a pass to from Ki Sung Young. And Renato Sanchez makes it 2 1. Two goals in two games. Come on. Right before half time, Ki Sung Young with the assist. The Korean Hullet. Yes, yeah, that's why I'm going to call him for now. The Korean Hullet. He can score. He can defend. He's tall. He's strong. 
He has a bit of pace to him. I don't think he has a lot of skill, it doesn't matter. Lovely pass by him though. Oh, Ogbonna left for dead. Adrian doesn't know what he's doing and Sanchez puts it into the back of net right before half time. I'm going to keep this recording going until the ref blows the whistle because there shouldn't be a lot more time. And there we go. 2 1 winning at the London Stadium. We might be able to pick up our first win, guys. We could do it. We actually could do this. We just need to either extend the lead or keep it. I'm going, to, I've gone defensive guys, so I'm kind of trying to seal this game up. If we can get another goal, it'll be game over pretty much. It goes out wide again. And here's the shot. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Tammy Abraham. Moon Knight with the assist. What a finish by Tammy Abraham. But I thought when I he finessed along the ground, I was going to go, oh, it's going wide. It has to be going wide. But nope, it sneaks in off the post. Moonine cuts inside from the wing. First time hit from Abraham. Off the post and in. There we go, guys. Our first three points. Abraham was third of the season as well. Byron's coming off. It doesn't matter. This game is pretty much over. First time finesse shot. Off the post and in. Ref's going to blow the whistle now. There we go. I'm happy with that now. 3-1 win against West Ham. Our first three points of the season. We definitely deserve to win with eight shots on target compared to West Ham's two. Man United lost 2-1 to Palace. Fuck me. And now we have a game coming up against Huddersfield, which we will sim. Oh, wow, you guys. I actually didn't notice. Tammy Abraham got the player of the month award. Wait. No way. We got a for Joe Roden. My friend, um, he did a Liverpool career mode and Coutinho... <laughs> You look cross-eyed. I think for half a second. Fuck off, England. I think Renato Sanchez was cross-eyed for like half a second. Hold on. Let me watch this. Please show it. Please. 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 Will it show it? No, that's not it. Oh my god. He actually looks cross-eyed. Fuck me. Why not? Wait. Oh, actually, no, he doesn't. Oh, wait. He... His left eye looks cross-eyed. His normal eye looks fine, but then his... Oh, my God. He looks like a spastic. I'm definitely going to put in... Oh, I'm going to... Oh God, I don't know. I'll try to think of something to do. You'll probably see it by now, but I'll try to think of something to do with that. His, like, his right eye looks fine, and then his left eye looks completely and utterly retarded. Oh, my God. That must be a glitch. Yeah, you need to fix that. Like, you can't have all the players have looking cross just because they're getting a few pictures done. I'm in our training session there. I'll do that right before. Ooh, what's many the performance? I'm okay to play, boss. Mm, fur. Okay, Roden's been loaned out. That's good to hear. Fur, boss, I'm feeling pretty good. Michael's have cleared me to play the next game with the slight chance of re injuring, injuring yourself. Hmm. I'll play him, but. I'm definitely going to keep Ki Sung Young on the bench because he was class this game. This, well, today when he played, that banger he scored. Like I said, he is the Korean root hullet. Just simple as that. Carol, I'm sorry. You have to piss off as Fur is back in the team. I will also play Olsen ahead of Cresswell. And I will play Ayu ahead of Kira and see how that works. That's good to know. Huddersfield have lost all three of their last games against Spurs, Burnley and Leicester. We've drawn against Spurs and we, lost, and we beat Leicester on penalties. We haven't played Burnley yet, to my knowledge. Hopefully we don't lose Huddersfield now and get two wins in a row. Two wins. First two wins in the Premier League. Nothing happened in the first ten minutes, which is kind of surprising. Lossell, Smith, Olsen gets a yellow card. No injuries so far. We'll skip it. You know what? That's not that bad. So, oh, Stark's injured. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, my God. You have to be joking me. You have to be kidding me. You have to be pulling my fucking nutsack. Everyone got us a late equaliser, but how long is Stark out for? Don't be long for the ones. Okay, it's only about three days. Thank God. Oh, I thought that was going to say three months for a second. He's okay to play the next game against... Who's it again? Leicester. Angel Rangel has a transfer request. I am happy to do that. Sorry to bunch of fans who actually like Angel Rangel. I don't think he even starts with them in real life. 
But that's it for the episode, guys. If you did like the video, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, share with your friends, all that good stuff. I'm going to end the video off with just the training session. We are sitting in 14th place with a Premier League win to our name. The future is looking bright right now. I do not want to do international manager. I don't care if it's Portugal. I don't care. I, think, I don't even care if it's the Republic of Ireland, okay? Oh, we can't do a training session. Brilliant. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And as always, I'll see you next time. Hello.